my name is Jochen and I'm the lead coach of the Impact Week Ghana 2023. Uh, and I'm uh, really proud to be part of a great team because in the end uh, most of the Impact Week is about teamwork. Um, we started this week uh, with the Train the Trainer where the goal is that we want to uh, train uh, 21 international junior coaches and uh, 21 local junior coaches in coaching design thinking. And we did this in a way that we do not talk about this, but they really experience design thinking as part of a team. And we have, an, we have really good senior coaches with them and they support them. And by doing design thinking and also reflecting what does it mean to coach such a process, they get familiar with, with this kind of, of work. And then uh, next week they have the, the big challenge and the big fun, I would say to really use this knowledge how to coach design thinking when they work with their own student teams because next week we will have a four days workshop with 21 teams and uh, in total more than 150 students. So this is a really, really big group and then the junior coaches uh, can directly use the knowledge they, they, they get this week to, to uh, coach the student teams uh, last week. Mm. What is interesting to know perhaps for you is that uh, um, design thinking of course is a process where you can create uh, new ideas, new products based on concrete challenges and therefore uh, also for the trainer the trainer we had a concrete challenge uh, which was around how to improve teaching uh, at, a, at, a, at a HCC uh, to become more innovative and uh, iterative and also uh, interactive and uh, the teams uh, looked for different aspects. They, they, at the first day, they started to talk to students and to teachers to really understand, okay, what are the needs of the students. And uh, as always, um, when you start using or when you start talking to users, you really see that there are completely different uh, needs uh, from the different people. And therefore, it's also no surprise that then the teams really uh, focused on different aspects. Yeah? So, for example, one team focuses on the, on, the, on the topic that there are more sports areas in, within, within the, the whole university and others, for example, focus on the topic for remote students that they have long trips with the bus coming to the university or driving them back in the evening and they, they thought about how can we improve the whole, the whole transportation for the, for the students by offering, for example, uh, specific university buses. Yeah? So this is always uh, what happens when you start asking users. You start with a relatively fluffy challenge and then you uh, can really nail this down to a concrete aspect um, when you really start talking to the users. And then based on this, you find the focus. And this was then in the middle of the workshop, you have a focus that you really better understand as a team for whom do you solve which problem? Yeah? And this, then you can really formulate a very concrete problem statement. And then in the second half of the workshop, typically we, we jump into the solution space uh, and we start building, uh, finding ideas. And we can also go for wild ideas, we can, we can dream. And then we want to immediately also test these ideas by building prototypes. And at the moment, uh, today is Friday, the third day of the Train the Trainer, the, the, the teams are uh, uh, out on the field and they really have their their, their prototypes with them and they uh, test and they, they show them to the students to get feedback and then also to iterate on this. Yeah? So this is, this is always uh, important that you really take time to understand the problem, that you really focus on the user and, 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 and uh, after the work that you really better understand the needs of the user, then you start finding ideas for that. Yeah? And as a frame around all the process, I would say it's teamwork because uh, when you talk about design thinking, of course, there are a lot of processes and methods you can use, and this is this is important that you have these kind of um, of um, of, um, of tools, I would say. But but uh, but uh, but uh, the, the background and the and the framing of uh, of everything is teamwork, and therefore it's really also important that we, for example, in the beginning of the day or at the end of the day, you really take time to check in and to check out, that you really invest time in team building, that there's a good energy in the team, that the team really can work together. Yeah? And for this, for example, we also do warm-ups. Uh, warm-ups can help to get energy and to, to, uh, to get to know each other and also to just have fun. Yeah? And therefore, we have also a mixture between teamwork, some inputs from my side, a little, a little only really, really little theory, and then some warm-ups to have also fun today. Yeah? And of course, we have a lot of sweets because sweets are also important. When you are creative, your brain needs a lot of energy and therefore we have a lot of sweets, which is good.
yeah, that's it. That's it. Uh, so today we will close the train the trainer with the final presentations, and then the junior coaches and the senior coaches together will prepare everything for next week. Over the weekend we will uh, enjoy our weekend, but then Monday morning we start with 150 students uh, in 21 teams and they will work on different challenges. Perhaps this is also interesting for you to know. We have different tracks, so we have seven tracks and each track has uh, three, three, three teams. And for each track we have some, some track mentors, so these are typically entrepreneurs from, from Ghana and they, they brought us, so to say, concrete challenges around topics like health, like transportation, like agriculture, like, uh, ed uh, like digitalization in education or like, edu uh, uh, like uh, entrepreneurial skills. Yeah? And the students will work on these challenges. But also for the Impact Week, it's, of course, the, the ideas we will create are important. But for me, at least, the biggest impact we can, we, we, we can create with the, with, with, with the Impact Week is the, that the people and the teams and the students really experience another way of working and another way of solving problems because when they experience that, of course, hopefully this will motivate them also to use this kind of working also for other projects at the university. And this is for me the biggest impact that people experience this way of working and then they can use this way of working also for their daily job, so to say. Yo. And I'm looking forward, I'm proud to be part of it. It's hot, it's ready and I like it. Thank you very much.